So Realme has officially announced that it is launching the GT2 series globally on the 4th of January next year. So far, we know that there is a vanilla Realme GT2, a more expensive Realme GT2 Pro and also a master edition phone. In my previous video on the GT2 Pro, I mainly talked about the design that we got to see via the leaked render but now the spec sheet of this phone is also out. We got to know the specifications via a Chinese certification agency named Tena. Now before I start talking about the specifications, there is one thing that needs explanation. If you go through the company's social media handles, you will see that the company has shared some images of a phone which looks similar to the Realme GT Neo 2 with that same camera module design. Now do not mistake this as the design of Realme GT2 Pro because this phone is actually the master edition, not the regular GT2 Pro. So the regular GT2 Pro will have the Nexus 6P inspired design which we saw earlier. Coming to the specifications now, Realme GT2 Pro has a 6.7 inch display and it is a 120Hz AMOLED with a Quad HD Plus resolution. There is Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 SoC and the phone has 8GB or 12GB of LPDDR5 RAM paired with up to half a terabyte of UFS 3.1 storage. According to a different leak, the phone also has a variant with 1TB of storage. There are three cameras on the back where two of the cameras have a 50 megapixel sensor. The third camera is not a telephoto lens as suspected earlier, rather it is a 2 megapixel sensor most likely for macro photos. Realme has already revealed that the 50 megapixel ultra wide camera has a field of view of 150 degrees, which is the largest we have ever seen on a smartphone camera. For selfies, there is a 32 megapixel camera. Now interestingly, the listing reveals the battery size to be 2440 mAh. The reason for that is the battery is split into two cells in order to support the Super VOOC or Super Dart charging technology. So this listing only shows the capacity of one of the two cells. Now assuming that the second cell has the same capacity, it is safe to say that Realme GT2 Pro has a battery size of around 5000 mAh. The charging speed was not revealed but this phone is expected to support 125W fast charging. And well, that's pretty much all we got to know. The launch is still more than a week away so we will definitely get to know more about the phone in the coming days. Anyways, what do you think of the Realme GT2 Pro? Do let me know via the comment section below and as always, I'll catch you in the next one.